Hey everybody, you are not gonna wanna miss this because today we are doing human torch science. That's fire bending in real life. I did this for my daughter's Harry Potter birthday party and it was a serious crowd pleaser. It is a great experiment to do at home as long as you take a lot of safety precautions because this is working with fire. One of the things I did, if you noticed, my hair is up in a ponytail because I definitely don't want to burn that off and it's got some hairspray in it which makes it extra flammable as you know. The items we'll be using today are a candle for the flame, matches to give it the flame. We have a bowl of warm soapy water. It's warm because my hands are cold because it's winter time. I used regular dish soap to put in here and I mixed the dish soap in the water as I was filling it up from the sink. I found that's the most effective way to really mix it in there well. And the last item on the list is butane fuel. You can pick this up at Walmart. I got mine at Ace Hardware and it costs between three and four dollars. And it's got this little pressure spout, kind of like a hairspray bottle. And if you spray it, a little bit of butane fuel will pop out. First thing I'm gonna do is light the candle so we have a flame. Now that we have our candle going, I'm gonna move it a little farther away while we add the flammable butane gas into our soapy bubbles. Now imagine you're blowing bubbles into soapy water with a straw. That's what we're gonna be doing with this. Because it's under pressure, we're gonna stick it in. Now you're gonna to wanna to get it all the way down in there and press down and that will release the gas and then we'll get lots of big thick bubbles. There we go. I'm gonna set this aside so no collateral damage. Now, bubbles stick to wet hands. So make sure your hands are fully wet by getting them all the way down in there, nice and wet. And what you want are the big bubbles at the top. Little bubbles burn slower than the big bubbles and so they'll be a little hotter on your hands. And as we know, flame rises. So the flames underneath your hand, you're gonna wanna minimize by trying getting off any bubbles off your hands. And if you want another great video on this, watch the ever amazing Grant Thompson from The King of Random. He gives a great video on this and the safety precautions. So now that I've got my bubbles, I'm gonna push this away and I'm gonna light it over our beautiful candle. Here we go. If your bubbles are running low, just add some more with your butane. That is why my hair is on a ponytail, people. That is why. All right, now for the biggest fireball of them all. I'm gonna blow this back up again, and we're gonna light the entire bowl by throwing the fire from my hand into the bowl and boom, boom. so. Yeah. Oh, no, Attempt number two. Yeah, that worked, woohoo! All right, now we're gonna have to do some more. All right, well thanks for joining me in this human torch science, and now you know how to fire bend in real life. If you have an experiment you want me to try, please leave it in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe. I am Shelly, the Little Black Shade Tree.